Hi, I'm Dennis Chan, and I'm from Jacksonville, Florida. Today we're going to go into my favorite market, right here on Beach Boulevard in Jacksonville. It's got, it's called Sarah's Market. It's got a great selection of fresh produce and a few Asian items and some Latin items. So we're going to look for some okra and some green tomatoes. We're going to make some fried green tomatoes. As a good southern boy, that's what one of my favorite things to make is. So come on in. We'll see what they have inside the market. Oh my goodness, they have so many things here. Some of these items, like fish sauce, is a little intimidating, but I'm happy to be someone's guide through this big maze of ingredients. beautiful fresh produce. What I like about this place is that you can see in the background they're always putting out fresh produce here all day long and as far as finding okra here's some beautiful okra locally grown and okra is used a lot in southern cooking and a lot in Southeast Asian cooking too so I think that uh, we can put them all together and make something really good out of this. Oh, score again. Here's some green tomatoes, and green tomatoes are a southern just delicacy. Everyone who thinks of the south thinks fried green tomatoes. So we're going to take some of these and do them in a Asian slash southern way, or hip Asian comfort food. That's the type of food that I like to cook. Tomato salad. Oh, and pickle okra. Pickle okra? Yeah, yep. Yeah. And some fried green tomatoes. Fried? Yeah. Fried tomatoes. Fry with okay. and cocoa okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Happy New Year. Yeah. Happy New Year. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. This is Sarah. Sarah is yeah. the hardest wo working person that I know. <laughs> and uh, I've known her for years, and she runs the best market in town. <laughs> 1161 in it. Hello, baby in the corner, same place. Hello. Thank you so much. Thank Happy you. Happy New Year. Oh, same to you, but Thank I'll you. be back today, afternoon. Okay. Okay. It's about an hour. We're going to finish load everything. Okay. Yeah. Thank Great. You. Thank you. Hello. Thanks for letting us take pictures, too. Hello. Hello. Okay, we made it back with our groceries to my restaurant, Blue Bamboo. Blue Bamboo opened in 2005 after I went to school at the Culinary Institute of America. Learned a little bit about how to eat. But even though I learned so much up there in New York and loved it up there, I had to come back to Florida, to Jacksonville, where I knew my heart was and where this good southern boy was able to cook the food that he loves. So come on in. Welcome to my kitchen. This is where all the magic happens. And in general, I like to keep all that crazy out of here. Eight years ago, I made my dreams come true by opening this restaurant. In those eight years, we developed a loyal clientele, and we really know what they want. Here in Jacksonville and throughout the whole South, a lot of okra is consumed. So we bought some beautiful fresh okra earlier today. And we're going to take and do this in a pickle um, so that we can have this anytime ready to eat. It's just going to sit in the refrigerator. And it makes a nice condiment to anything you're eating. 
but we're going to add some Indian flavors to this. So we take a little bit of salt, sugar, and water that we've boiled. We're going to cover our okra in this pickling liquid and add a little bit of curry powder and some chili powder to this. Give this a good mix. We're going to stick this in the refrigerator for about 20 minutes to days if you want to. And we will have our beautiful pickled okra in just a few minutes. So these are our beautiful fry, uh, tomatoes that we're going to slice. And we're going to fry them in a way that is unique to uh, Jacksonville. And we've taken these green tomatoes. We're going to do standard breading procedure. And standard breading procedure is simply flour, any liquid like buttermilk. And we're using panko breadcrumbs. These are Japanese breadcrumbs that add such a nice texture to anything that you fry. Now, the important thing to remember when you're breading is you always keep one hand wet and one hand dry. Otherwise, you end up with monster hands when you're frying. So we're going to take this, fry it up, and then we'll get to sample. Oh yeah, this is my favorite time of the day where we get to sit down and enjoy the beautiful food that we just made. I already showed you our pickled okra. I'm going to show you our finished product of our fried green tomatoes. It's got a little bit of goat cheese, a little bit of basil, and a little bit of balsamic vinegar just drizzled on top. With dishes like these, put Jacksonville on that culinary map.